Taking a look at Pixel Soccer, um, that's from Super Rock Games. Uh, Kickstarter run in the moment. They're on six thousand pound, looking to get twenty five thousand. Only six days to go. Um, if you follow their Twitter account um, or Facebook, you'll know that they make all the cool little pixel players. And through the World Cup, they've been quite popular. So now they've got a game being made. So I thought I'd give you a quick look at it. Um, before I had a quick go. Um, Controls are a little bit difficult at times, passing, um, taking goal kicks is a little bit of a pain, but you get a rough idea of how uh, how it's looking so far. Well, let's skip the latest news, okay. So it looks like you'll be able to do a season, be able to enter a cup, career mode, editor, which will probably be handy if you want all the real player names. And I can show you a quick friendly. Um, but a few goes of this, probably show you bits and pieces of the footage, but uh, I'll show you what the start of the match is like. So I'm going to pick Liverpool and I'm going to go for their away kit. And let's play Chelsea. Change them to a computer. You can play another person, two people on one keyboard, but I'll show you this against a computer. So there's no sound at the moment, um, which is a bit of a shame, but I guess this is uh, an early demo. Um, all the graphics look quite cool. It stays quite true to the old sensible soccer games. Oh, okay, here we go, here's kickoff. All the players have a slight likeness of the real the real person, the real player, which is quite cool. Um, controls are really simple, just got arrow keys and uh, pass, right. It's, you can let's to Suarez to start. I found the easiest way to score is just kind of oh <laughs> well not like that. Uh, they'll probably score now because tackling is really tough. Oh okay. Okay I think he's missed. You don't always know when they've missed because the ball will go through the net and it's hard to tell if it's gone over or not. But the most difficult part I've found so far is taking the goal kicks. If you touch it, it'll go about a foot. If I hold it down for like a split second, it goes quite far. So they, that's the. And I've missed the ball. Bloody great. So yeah, the, one of the toughest parts of the game seems to be taking the goal kicks. And that's why I keep losing. Oh, okay. I haven't seen a good corner yet either. Right. Seems easier just to run with the ball than to pass it, but I will try a pass. Oh, it's gone straight in, okay. One in Liverpool. It's a better start than I usually get anyway. And we're beating Chelsea, brilliant. Right. It's quite tough to get the ball back, I find. If you just hold them up, they will run backwards. Oh, he's giving me the ball. Nope. Passing is tough, but I'm slowly getting used to it. Ish. If you want to change players, you basically just, just got to stop chasing and then as soon as they get closer to a, another player, you'll take control of those. Oh, and he scored a good goal. Tony Kelly, alright, whoever he is. guess they're not licensed to use the real names, but I guess that's what the edit is for. And this is Suarez. And that should be a goal. The ball has gone through the net, but Hey, this is Alpha. Right. You can see there, it, cha it changes player sometimes in the most awkward position. And that's a goal. Looked like he saved it, but okay, we two all. Oh, I've done it again. Adventurous there with a the shot. Right, let's try and get this to go to my player. Oh, it's gone straight out. That's what I usually do. But it's better than playing it forward because he doesn't get any air on the ball. And what would be nice is, oh god, and now okay, I'm losing 3 2. 
be nice to have some sort of kick meter, especially not so much for shooting, but definitely for the goalkeeper. Right, if I can pass this. Ah, there we go. Now that'll probably count as a goal, even though it's into the post. There we go, 3 all. Don't want to lose to Chelsea. Right, I gotta let him go to get the. Ah, oh, it's too late, he scored. You see, defending is so hard, you can't. There's no way to change focus on the players. Right, okay. I'm gonna try, rather than just score a goal, I'm gonna try and pass the ball a couple of times. Come on, go back. Oh, <laughs> he scores! Right, I was trying to cross that, I remember I got a bit lucky there. That's a goal. It would be nice to see the ball rubble in the back of the net. It's kind of disappointing when it goes <laughs> straight through. Oh, Jesus, they're fast. Oh, oh, no. Oh, okay. The ball can't hit your head by the looks of it, and I've just set up a goal. Right. Let's try and get one back. There we go. See, it's not a lot of satisfaction that they only bothered celebrating. Okay, they missed. Right. I'll show you what happens when you kick it straight out. Oh, I've actually won it. That's the first time <laughs> I've got the ball. I'm not oh, I didn't oh, what's that? That was a free kick for some reason. Ah, this is what I'm saying. They just randomly stop attacking. They'll defend and they'll get the ball back, but they just stop attacking. So I can, if I can just get away from him. Okay, so I'll leave the demo there. I'll um, go through a couple of replays from some of my other goals. Um, it's quite difficult to control. It's quite difficult to pass. You really need some sort of visual guide of how hard you're kicking it. Um, you could really do with um, being able to change players a little bit easier. But apart from that, it seems like a, a good start. I like the uh, the pixel art. So. Interesting to see where this one goes. Thanks for watching. What's the use in getting so worked up when you can just let it go and go with the flow? Just let it go and go with the flow. Nobody cares for me. Yep, here we go. Ah, oh, that was shocking. Come on, god damn it!